the first live semi-final of Britain's Got Talent, where nine acts are doing battle to try and make it all the way to the Royal Variety performance. Next up tonight is a gymnastics team from Scotland. And these guys... These guys are dressed like ancient warriors in battle clothes of all. With just the merest hint of fake tan. Mm. It's Spartans Resurrection. <laughs> Spartans! We are Spartans Resurrection. We're a gymnastics team from Dunfermline in Scotland. This group has been together for about eight years, ages from the age of 13 to 23, and there's 17 of us. <laughs> Sheila's our coach. She's the most dedicated person I know. Almost looking like a team, boy. My first group that I had 22 years ago, there are kids are now coming to the gymnastics as well, which is a bit scary. <laughs> Our first edition went really well. We got San Innovation and four yeses. It was dangerous, it was thrilling. You are all so incredible. Best film ever. Let's go! For getting ready for tonight's performance, we've been coming to the gym seven days a week. There's a lot more pressure with it being live on TV. There's a lot that could go wrong. If they don't get the timing right, they could be really badly hurt. We've got bigger moves, bigger tricks. We're all buzzing to get out there and show them what we have. There was so much potential in this act. I thought the whole Troy film and the battling over the beautiful princess was really well done. I still feel like there's more to see from you, but what you did there was showcase what you do brilliantly, but I know that if you get through to the finals, you've got to come out and make it even more dangerous, but very well done. is that you show a real commitment, there's a real togetherness, there's, there's a real grit to, to all of you. I have to say, I thought there was going to be a bigger ending with that. I thought there was lots of little stories being told, and it was very good, but I felt like there should have been a bigger ending. A and proposal. like Alicia said... I know, even bigger than that, Simon. Or bigger than a proposal. Bigger than a proposal, which would be good for someone like you to do, but maybe not for... <laughs> Tonight on yeah. the show, she'll be watching. <laughs> okay. Will you marry me? Yes! <laughs> it's like a living nightmare. Guys, I agree with what the girls said. I, I like with something like this to kind of for you to <laughs> looking at me dead, for you to tell a story. Um, and the story was somersaults and then a proposal. So the end part was okay. I just didn't get the beginning part. 
Although I do think, in terms of effort, the costumes, it was better than the first audition. But like Alicia said, if you're lucky enough to make it through to the finals, you've got to do something bigger. It's got to be a more understanding story. But 10 out of 10 for effort, guys. And go. <laughs> Fantastic. Just want to echo everyone said. It was really, really dramatic, really, really intense, and there was you, it was so dangerous at times. It was fantastic, and I nearly wore the outfit tonight, so it's very <laughs> lucky. <laughs> I think I'm dressed in that. That's what the judges have to say. If you think Spartans Resurrection are the pride of Scotland, then call 0904 from a landline. From your mobile, it's 644 2402, or you can vote via the app, but not until the end of the show. One more time, Spartans Resurrection. Toggle of the Britain's Got Talent app, like you just were three seconds ago. You get five free votes per night. You can blow all five in one act or share them out across a different five acts. Do what you like. We don't care. You can also play along <laughs> with the show live, so do yourself a favour and get involved get with the app. Get involved. Time for a quick break now, but when we come back, we've got live performances from Songbird Kathleen Jenkins and Street Dance Crew Total TXS. See you in a few.